Hi everyone, it's Michelle. I wanted to talk a little bit about setting up your technology um, centers or your spaces. And I'm showing you a little bit of how I set everything up, but a lot of the things we do um, are on the tablet. And as I've said before, the tablet helps to reinforce a lot of the topics or subject areas that I'm teaching the children. And we only spend a short amount of time on the tablets. The older you are, the longer you can spend on the tablet um, with me, but normally it's maybe 10 minutes or something like that. So I'm normally reinforcing something. So if I'm teaching letters, I will have um, an app downloaded on the tablet so that the children can listen to or watch something like Starfall. Um, or if I'm teaching numbers, I'll have an app on there um, that uh, teaches a little bit more of the math. And so what I'm gonna do is just give you a little bit of an example of some of the apps that I have downloaded um, on the tablets. And as you can see, I have the, um, the headphones as well because every child is not going to be watching the same thing uh, or learning the same thing and I also keep the boxes for the headphones in the middle it blocks so that the children can't see what anybody else is doing um, and it also reinforces them to clean up when they're finished with their headphones and then they will plug in their tablets back over by the larger computer. Now, before I get started with talking about the apps, uh, the larger computer normally is used for, um, if I need to put one of the children on for a special um, CD or something in terms of reading or writing uh, or some type of math or some type of reinforcement. So sometimes you may have a child who needs a little bit more um, of a lesson than you did for that day. And so that will be where they will have that uh, space, that individual space and that time for themselves so that they're not distracted. All right, so let's get into some of the apps that I have downloaded. And you can go to Play Store or um, I guess if you have the iPad, you can go to that and download a lot of these things. Here. And a lot of parents ask me, what types of apps do I download on my tablets? And so here's a little bit of a sampling. So Starfall ABCs, which is a wonderful app that, um, that uh, reinforces letters, letter sounds, and they also have another one called Starfall, Starfall Learn to Read, and the children can learn to read using Starfall. Um, and it's free and um, it's wonderful. It's a wonderful reinforcement and it's a wonderful tool for teaching as well. I have ABC Kids, ABC Spelling, Kids Spelling, Sight Words Coach, Math Kids, Play and Learn Science, um, Piano Kids Music, Colors and Shapes, uh, Toy Pop Cubes. That's also a, a fun one that a lot of the kids like to play with. Um, <clears throat> I have um, Colors and Shapes, ABC Spell, ABC Kids, and Duolingual is a nice one for learning languages. And I have Starts, I have, excuse me, Sight Words, Sentences, Kids Flashcards, um, Kinder Tales, and Khan Academy and I think I forgot one preschool learning and so those are just some of the apps that we use I'm um, usually looking on the app store for different apps and the way I look for them is I like for them to not have ads and there are a lot of apps that do not have the advertisements on them because what happens is the children like to click on them or they see something pop up um, of course and they're going to click on it or they're going to try to get out of it and they may end up clicking on it and 
uh, it causes a whole big mess and they get upset and they don't want to see that so uh, if you can pick those that don't have uh, the advertisements that would be great so just to give you a little bit again of my space okay for my technology and you can set it up any way you want to um, sometimes I set it up in the space within the playroom um, but I like to have the technology separate because like I said they're working on something and so I don't want them to be distracted all right, so what are your ideas for using the tablet? Uh, let me know in the comments and I will talk to you in the next video.